Oliver, how much how much different was that Montreal team tonight than you played uh, a couple of weeks ago, and, and how much uh, more of a challenge did they present? I guess. Yeah, it definitely felt like they competed more, so um, they made it hard hard on us. But I I thought we were pushing back hard and um, played a good game. Yeah. Uh, let's go right to the power play there at the end of the game and, and what the strategy was, what you're thinking. Obviously, there's, what, a minute and a half left or whatever. Yeah, we, uh, we didn't want to change anything, just stick to the game plan. Um, you know, I didn't feel like we panicked or anything and stay patient. And um, obviously, in the end, we set Patty up and um, really nice shot. So Yeah, that's the, the vintage line A one-timer. How cognizant, uh, aware are you of where he is during that power play at all times, trying to set him up for that? Um, yeah, I mean, obviously we want to, we know a lot of times the other teams want to cover him, but, um, you know, anytime we can get a puck over in his side and he get a shot off, it's a good chance. So, um, yeah, we always like doing that, but, um, yeah, I don't know. Yeah. Probably have to tip your head a little bit to Montemelli play a really good game. Was it, did you guys have a penalty from the frustration of just making kind of some pretty big saves on you guys? Yeah, I think we just stuck with it. We didn't panic. Um, you know, I think we had some really good chances throughout the game and could have had a few more goals, but he played well. So um, when goalies play well, you just got to stick with it and, um, you know, wait for a puck to go in. And that was kind of the type of game we had tonight. You guys have won two games this week in the last minute. Just feel like there's some good vibes kind of going right now. Yeah, yeah, no, it's it's it's, it's obviously nice. Um, I think that just, you know, proves that we stick with it and, Again, like we don't get frustrated uh, towards the end of the game. It's, it's tied, but, uh, you know, to stick to the game plan, we keep pushing. So that's why we're able to get those goals. Go to uh, Zoom. Go ahead, Forty. Thanks, Glenn. Oliver, on that line A power play goal right at the end there, how much was Voracek's uh, willingness to shoot? I think he took two shots pretty close to each other. How much did that sort of draw attention away from line A, even for just a half second to give him a shooting lane there? Yeah, I think that helps. I think, uh, you know, you can't have a power play where you're just trying to set up one guy. You have to have different options. And uh, when you utilize every player um, and, you know, uh, get different scoring chances, it obviously makes him think that uh, the puck can go in the net from somewhere else. So it opens up uh, a pass to Patty. And I think that's what happened there. You guys have won five in a row now on the road, which was a real struggle for you earlier this season, winning on the road. How sweet does that feel and, and what's behind your road success now if you can if you can pinpoint anything uh part I, th I think it's a mindset um you know we, we want to win games and you got to win road games so um no i just think we're, we're just playing better hockey and um i don't know i think we're just more ready to play on the road than we have been